Reaper, Reaper. Probably check out that armor later. Actually, I'll probably do it right now because I'm bored. And by bored, I mean I want to see what I got. And I can't even use it because it's heavy armor. The shit. The life of of a shepherd is a is a bad one. Well, that grenade actually went nowhere. I'm upset. Also, please die. No, 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 no. Kill it, kill it, kill it. Kaden, push him. What a good guy. Kaden's got a big dick. Yay, killed all these fucking bad guys. Now it's time to explore, and I'm fatigued apparently. I can only run for like two seconds, I guess. Shit. For a guy who's in the military, you know, you you think Shepard would be able to run faster and you know longer, but he can only run for like two seconds. It's 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 his curse, honestly. You know, we don't talk about it. He doesn't talk about it, but it's his curse. He doesn't do cardio, I guess. He just he just fucking I don't. Need, he's not even buff either. I don't know what he does. I guess he just eats right. And they're just like, you know what, Shepard? That's that's good enough for us. Is there something else over here? Because I don't want to go over here. And there's nothing over here, and I just wasted like two seconds or whatever. I wasted two seconds or whatever. All right. Let's get the bastards. Wow, well, Ashley, please. This is the PG PG channel. You can't say stuff like that. You just you just can't go around swearing. That's wrong. That's not the beacon. This is the beacon. That's a grenade. But this is a crate. You know, the grenade actually helped me find the crate. So in the end, it was worth wasting the grenade. I think it looks weird, but oddly pretty. Normandy, the beacon is secure. This is amazing. Immediate... Actual working Prothean technology. Unbelievable. It wasn't doing anything like that when they dug it up. That's probably because you guys didn't know how to Something activate it, you activated. fucking weirdos. Roger, Normandy. Standing by. Ashley, what are you doing? Oh. What a hero. No, don't touch it. It's too dangerous. Wow, I broke some sort of old ancient alien technology. I'm gonna get fired. This coke is warm. Identified the ship that touched down on Eden Prime, the Normandy, a human alliance vessel. It was under the command of Captain Anderson. They managed to save the colony. And the beacon. One of the humans may have used it. Oh no. You won't like him when he's mad. Boy, howdy, you shouldn't do that. I am... You know who I am? I'm... Pancake Shepherd. I was gonna say John Shepherd, but my name isn't John in this. It's actually Pancakes. Because that's the shitty name I chose Doctor, for my Shepherd. Dr. Chakwas, I think he's waking up. Poor Shepherd. It's hot in here. You had us worried there, Shepherd. How are you feeling? Uh, not great. Like the morning after shore leave. How long was I out? About 15 hours. Something happened down there with the beacon, I think. It's my fault. I must have triggered some kind of security field when I approached it. You had to push me out of the way. You had no way to know what would happen. Actually, we don't even oh, know. Oh, I made her smile. 
Unfortunately, we'll never get the chance to find out. The beacon exploded. A system overload, maybe. The blast knocked you cold. The lieutenant and I carried you back here to the ship. I appreciate it. Physically, you're fine. Oh man, now she thinks I like her because I said thanks. Brain activity. Did I just get dressed right away? <laughs> yeah, I did I apparently. I noticed an increase in your rapid eye movement. Signs typically associated with intense dreaming. It was a I vision saw. of evil, darkness, death, destruction, sick parties. Really clear. Hmm. I better add this to my report. It may. Oh. Captain Anderson. How's our exo holding up, Doctor? Well, all the readings look normal. I'd say the command is going to be fine. Glad to hear it. Shepard, I need to speak with you. In private. Aye, aye, Captain. I'll be in the mess if you need me. Sounds like that beacon hit you pretty hard, Commander. Are you sure you're okay? Uh, I'm pissed about the gas. Intel dropped the ball, sir. We had no idea what we were walking into down there. That's why things went to hell. The Geth haven't been outside the Vale in two centuries, Commander. Nobody could have predicted this. I feel bad about Jenkins, you know, he just got wrecked. He just went out there, wanted to be a good soldier. Got shot dead, I don't instantly. Like soldiers dying under my command. Jenkins wasn't your fault. You did a good job, Shepard. Uh, let's see, uh... Chief Williams isn't part of the Normandy crew. I figured we could use a soldier like her. She's been reassigned to the Normandy. Williams is a good soldier. She deserves it. Lieutenant Elenko agrees with you. That's why I added her to our crew. You said you needed to see me in private, Captain? I won't lie to you, Shepard. Things look bad. Nihilus is dead. The beacon was destroyed and Gether invading. The Council's going to want answers. Hey, I mean, we, we got nothing to hide. We did everything, wrong, right? Captain. Hopefully the Council can see that. I'll stand behind you and your report, Shepard. You're a damned hero in my books. That's not oh, why. Thank you. It's Saren, that other Turian. Saren's a specter, one of the best, a living legend. But if he's working with the Gith, it means he's gone rogue. A rogue specter's trouble. Saren's dangerous, and he hates humans. Why? He thinks we're growing too fast, taking over the galaxy. A lot of aliens think that way. Most of them don't do anything about it. But Saren has allied himself with the Geth. I don't know how. I don't know why. I only know it had something to do with that beacon. You were there just before that beacon self-destructed. Did you see anything? Any clue that might tell us what Saren was after? Just before I lost consciousness, I had some kind of vision. A vision? A vision of what? I saw oh, some thinning. Geth, maybe. Slaughtering people. Butchering them. We need to report this to the Council, Shepard. What are we going to tell them? I had a bad dream? <laughs> we yeah. don't know what information was stored in that beacon. Lost Prothean technology? Blueprints for some ancient weapon of mass destruction? Whatever it was. Saren took it. But I know Saren. I know his reputation is politics. He believes humans are a blight on the galaxy. This attack was an act of war. He has the secrets from the beacon. He has an army of Geth at his command, and he won't stop until he's wiped humanity from the face of the galaxy. I'll stop him. I'll find some way to take him down. It's not that easy. He's a specter. He can go anywhere, do almost anything. That's why we need the Council on our side. We prove Saren's gone rogue, and the Council will revoke his specter status. I'll contact the Ambassador, and see if he can get us an audience with the Council. He'll want to see us as soon as we reach the Citadel. We should be getting close. Head up to the bridge and tell Joker to bring us into dock. Hey, sure, you know, okay, I got that. Alright, so... Before I end this off here, just little final thoughts. So this whole game revolves around Shepard, because he's, he's got the fucking Prothean data in his brain. If... Ashley had got that in her brain, we'd probably be playing as Ashley. So that's yeah, that's a little thought, you know. The whole series would be completely different if, if Shepard didn't push her out the way. But uh, I hope you liked this this uh, this session of Mass Effect One. 
uh, you know, so don't forget to like, favorite, comment, subscribe, call me an idiot. Say that my shepherd's name is bad, say that green eyes are terrible, you know, whatever makes you feel good about yourself in, in the end of the day. And, uh, yeah, thank you for watching, and, yeah, bye. Say goodbye, shepherd. Yep, that's pretty much, that's, that's all he's gotta say. It's, he's real talkative, honestly. Alright, see you later, goodbye, bye-bye-bye-bye-bye.